So here's a little Halloween special for you. I came up with this recipe a few years ago because living in Texas sometimes means that you come across some cockroaches. And these cockroaches here have about the size of my thumb and uh, they totally freak me out. Some of them, the male version has, uh, has wings and even can fly. So it's super creepy and no fun to be honest. But uh, so since they are so creepy, I thought let's make something with that. No, we are not preparing real cockroaches. So don't worry about that. What we are doing is we, we prepare something that looks like cockroaches, but not just like any cockroach, they look like bursted cockroaches. Super creepy. My daughter hates them because she can't stand what they look like. But see for yourself. You really don't need much for this recipe. What you need is you need some fresh dates. Well, how fresh are they? So they are, they are not the dried version. You know what I mean? You also need some cream cheese and you need some caramel syrup. Um, you could also add some powder or confectioner's sugar to the cream cheese. I personally find it too sweet. Uh, I did it once and I just felt like, oh, that's too much. Um, depends on your own taste. I like it with just the, the cream cheese, but you can mix the cream cheese with some um, confectioner's sugars if you want to. So what I'm doing is super simple. Let me first open this. So I take one of these dates, also known as cockroaches now, and I cut them half open and I remove the stone. Okay, and then I take some of this cream cheese, which has room temperature, which makes it so much easier to work with it. And if you didn't take it out in time, you can also put it in the microwave for a few seconds. So this is my first one. And I will also take one and slice it like this and make some antennas. So, that's too thin. So this is the antenna. Okay, you could also make some bacon and fry it and uh, put it, make it into very small pieces and crumble them on top of them. That's also something you could do so it looks like some organs came out. It's Halloween, I'm allowed to say that, right? So I really like Halloween. I made amazing costumes for my kids when they were younger and now they are feeling like they are too old. So we don't do that anymore, sadly. Yeah, and I will just continue to do this. And then I show you what else I need to do. Yeah, so I think they look pretty realistic. And um, I don't know if you have ever seen one of these large cockroaches. So trust me on that. They really look like that. And now I use my caramel um, syrup and make sure that they look even more realistic by just getting some of this syrup out. It's a little difficult to get just a little out. And I remember when my father-in-law was here to visit us one year in the morning he said, oh, this morning I saw a cockroach in the kitchen. I was, oh, what did you do? And he said, oh, I stepped on it. So I didn't see the picture of it. I didn't see what it looked like because he had already removed the cockroach, thankfully. But I'm assuming it looked a little bit like that. Okay, so I hope you take this with some humor. 
Happy Halloween and have fun creeping out your guests. Ooh, I think this one is still moving. Yeah, and as creepy as it looks, um, they're really delicious, trust me. Well, I'll prove it to you. So I'll have one just in front of you, so you can see that I really eat these. Mm. It's really good. 